What's happening, everybody? I'll, I'll try to bring my energy. Um, I don't think I need this microphone. <laughs> wow, what an experience, huh? I think it's been pretty uh, life-changing for every single one of us here. That Not even here, the people across the country, through the TV, you know, people reading your story, Amanda. I think it's been one of the most incredible uh, uplifting tales that I can, you know, remember at all. And I'm so just honored to have been a part of this experience. Um, you know, so many of you came out every single day and put so many tireless hours and so much effort and passion and love into this whole crazy idea because we really didn't know if you were really out there. You know, we just had to believe. You know, we, we had to just stick to the fact that you were in that forest. And in my soul, I was like, there's no other evidence that points anywhere, uh, anywhere else. So the only way, reason we haven't seen her or smelled her is because she's way past what we think she's doing and she's way stronger than what we think she can do. And she, she's, she's still walking. And that's why, that's why you're so far away. <laughs> I can't thank all of you enough for all the love and support. I know that I'm like a super hyper positive guy. <laughs> But all your love and support kept me going, kept my motivation just at max capacity. I was pretty much trying to walk through the freaking top of Halak alive I had to, to find you. And I tried. And you can do it, so don't do that. Um, and this has been like the most incredible experience for this for, for, for my life and for this community. And I think that we just showed each other, and I know I've kind of repeated myself that it doesn't matter who you are or where you come from and what country you're from and who you believe in and who you love. It's about this, guys. It's about our heart, and that's what we share. That's the story that we share as a human story, the story of love and support and community, and this is what it's supposed to be about. It's not supposed to be about divisiveness and finger pointing and being separated and segregated and, you know, we win and they would lose. It's about coming together. It's about loving each other for who we are. And I can personally say that my entire soul has changed and I look at human beings. I look at people differently. I freaking love all of you 100% from the bottom of my heart. And Amanda, I love you so much, girl, that I was going to be damned if I was going to leave you out in the woods. Especially if I knew that you're still out there. So, uh, I can't thank you for all the love and support. And I got to tell you that the Eller family is the strongest family that I have ever met. This man, that man over there, Julia, who is beyond my hyper positivity, is freaking just incredible. And every single one of you, you are what made this happen. Okay, we may have been the ones on the chopper, but you're the ones that put us on the chopper. Okay, you're the ones that kept us going, kept supporting us, kept coming back and letting us know, you know what? We are doing something right. We are doing something that matters and we're not going to freaking stop until that girl is back with this family. So thank you guys so much. I love you all so much. Christina, thank you so much for supporting me. Alexander, my biggest supporter all the way. I love you so much, son. There he is. Alexander put six miles to this search, by the way. He made it all the way out to Opana Gulch. So, uh, and this is a team that, I mean, without, without this team and without these people, without you, dude, and without Troy Helmer in the back, okay? Seriously, I've got to give mad props to my friend Troy Helmer and to every single volunteer that was out there. Thank you so much, guys. I love you. Thank you.